guys, this week on Hell Booties is advice week, and so I'm going to be teaching you how to get your favorite YouTuber or celebrity to notice you, because I'm pretty good at it, not gonna lie. Um, if you haven't checked out the part one of how to create a fan account, go check out last week's video. But today, I'm going to be teaching you how to get your favorite person to notice you. So, let's get started. Um, so, pretty much, like, once you have your fan account and you're active on it and stuff like that, Really, there's no real number system. Like last week, I had like four simple steps. And this week, I don't really have any steps. I just have like what I did because I was in I was in two different fandoms. I was in one fandom for about four years, and now I'm in a different fandom. And so, when I was in the first fandom for four years. I pretty much just wrote or tweeted, oh, before I get into that, when you get into a fandom, make sure you figure out what social media platform is used most. Like la the first fandom I was in, the it was Twitter that was used the most, and in the fandom I'm in now, it's Tumblr. But um. So, first, figure out what platform you use the most. And for the first fandom, it was Twitter, and I tweeted my favorite celebrity every single, at least once a day, every single day, for about two years, until she noticed me. And it all, it's a waiting game. When it comes down to it, it's a waiting game. It will happen to you eventually, but you just have to be consistent. Consistency is key. But for the fandom I'm in now, the Grace Helbig fandom, or the Holy Trinity fandom, if you want to call it that, um, I have been noticed by Grace Helbig, I think, 160 times. And I've been in this fandom for about seven months. So, let well, let's start. Okay. So, once you create your account and you're active on it, you want to make sure that the person, that your favorite person, knows who you are. And so, if you tag them in everything that you post, whether it be on Twitter or Instagram or Tumblr. Um, this is a very difficult video for me to do, but, um, you want to make sure that they know who you are, and so if you get the chance, this is what really got me started, was if you get the chance to talk to your favorite YouTuber, or favorite celebrity, I'm going to stick to the YouTuber thing, because Grace Helbig is a YouTuber, and hopefully an actress soon, well she is an actress, but hopefully she has her own TV show by the time this video comes out. But, um, with the YouTubers on Tumblr, well, make sure that if you get the chance to talk to her, or talk to them, whether it be on a radio show, or HuffPost Live, or anything like that, make sure you tell them your Tumblr name. If it's, if it's based on Tumblr, Tell them your Tumblr name. Don't be what what I did was I told Grace Helbig my Tumblr name. Not even thinking that she was gonna notice me at all. I just wanted that connection. I wanted to be able to connect with her through something that she was used to. And so I told her my Tumblr name. She got a, rot a kick out of it. Everybody, I, I got to talk to her on um, Lance Bass's radio show. 
you know, on September 16th of 2014. Yes, I know I'm weird. I remember the dates. But anyway, and I told her my Tumblr name, and I didn't even think that she was going to notice me at all, and she didn't until the day after. On September 17th was when she started noticing my Tumblr more and more. And... That, it was crazy at first because I thought that she had, she would go, excuse me, I thought she would go on my account every single night just to check up to see what I was doing and so I decided to change up my account a little bit and make sure I was entertaining her with stuff and not posting like non complete nonsense. But then I realized that she wasn't just going on my account, she was just checking her tags like she does. Because she does stalk her tags. As most of you know. And so, yeah. It's really going back to the whole waiting game thing. Like, you post on with, in the tags and you just have to wait and see if she notices it. There's no real way to get noticed without it being a waiting game. Unless your favorite person follows you on Twitter or follows you on any social media, then then you could possibly get closer to them and have them like your stuff. And no, for the people who are wondering, Grace Helbig does not follow me on Tumblr. She just notices me in the tags because, like I said in last week's video, I have a hard time being too active on my accounts. Um, and so yeah, hopefully this advice video is good enough because I'm doing this on the same day as last week's video because I might possibly be on a cruise at if I'm not on a cruise, then I will probably redo this video. But if you hear me saying that I'll redo this video, that means that I did not re redo this video. And so yeah, that's advice week. And check out tomorrow's video with L. And oh, before I go, and I forgot to mention this last week, but I just reached 906 followers on Tumblr, and my goal is to get to a thousand by New Year's, or by 2015. And so if you want to follow me, down below is all my social media links, along with Hellbooties stuff. And I've realized that the Hellbooties Instagram is the most used because we do have a Twitter and a Tumblr, but we use Instagram more often. So make sure you follow Instagram. Make sure you follow all of uh, all of our social media. But if you want to get in touch with us, the best way is through Instagram. And so yeah, that's it. So like this video if you like it. Comment down below for ideas that we can do. Um, yeah. And subscribe. Okay. Bye, guys. <laughs>